Hey guys, welcome back to the SS Talk Show. And in the last video, we discussed when is the demand actually going to come in to support this oversupplied market and how can you benefit from it. In this video, we discuss how. So we've noticed a trend and if you time the market correctly, you're going to be able to benefit from the next swing up and we think that this is likely going to be in 2023 to 2024 and here's why. So the big three factors we're looking at when we talk about property prices increment is number one, population growth. Number two is infrastructure and number three is government policy. So we know that government has stipulated that we're headed towards a 6.09 million population by the year 2023. So this means that we have to grow from our current 5.8 million. When more people come in, this means the demand will grow because they need more houses. And this in turn will lead to developers having to supply that demand. And this leads them to actually buy more land. When they buy more land, this actually drives the land prices up, ultimately driving up property prices. That is because in Singapore, land is scarce. So we notice another price trend backed by facts and figures. And this is, whenever the government eases cooling measures, this causes prices to run upwards. And this is how we know. In 2017 March, when the government eased cooling measures of the seller stamp duty from four years to just three years, prices increased across the three regions in Singapore. Here are some examples. So Martin Modern and CCR saw a price increment of $620 per square feet in just five quarters from Q3 2017 to Q3 2018. In the same time frame, we also saw an appreciation for Kingsford Water Bay, which is in Upper Serangoon, by $170 per square feet. In the same time frame, we also saw Grandio Park which is in Tanah Merah, appreciated by $194 per square feet. So the real question to ask is, why did the government tweak the cooling measures then? And how can you time the market for the next wave up? I'm Nick Tan, Selling Singapore, and we'll answer this question in our next video. See you soon.